Hello YouTubers, welcome to my channel. Like and subscribe and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you know when new content comes out. Welcome back to my channel. Hey viewers, this is Sam's Automotive bringing you another how to do DIY. Today we have a 2006 Honda Mighty CRV. All right, so today I'm going to show you how to do a water pump. Okay, things that you need to remove to do this water pump. You need to remove the tensioner, the motor, the motor mount, the mount where the motor, motor mount goes, which is the base. You need to remove that piece. You need to remove the wheel. Once you have the wheel removed, you need to remove the power steering. Here is our new water pump, and this is the way it goes. You got three bolts here, and you got three bolts on the bottom, as you guys can see there. A six, a total of six bolts. So as you can see here, I'm going to show you real quick with the light. Here we go. This is a this is a look from the top. So three bolts are going to come from the top and the other bolts are going to come from the bottom. The other thing you need to remove, you got to make this uh, line to the side. So you have access of pulling the bolt that goes right down here, this guy here, okay? So that's gonna be for that mount right there. And don't forget to drain your antifreeze and then everything goes on the reverse way. The line needs to be removed as well on the power steering pump. Just put it to the side so it doesn't be in your way. Um, your power steering pump, put it on the side, and this is a view from the top. You guys can see three bolts there. There's our water pump. This is our water pump right here. That's three bolts. Uh, you don't need to remove the alternator. So as you can see now, we're pull the water pump through here and it's going to come through here all right so the next step is removing the wheel and get the rest of the uh three bolts here as you can see the other bolts right here the other three bolts there's one right here there's one right here there's one behind and one in the front and watch out for your face because antifreeze is going to come on the way okay thank you for watching this is sam's automotive give me a thumbs up if you have any question let me know god bless you